Hey everyone, it's Andrew here, and you're watching Toronto Daily Homes and Condos.com, and it's Tuesday, November 15th. Uh, I've got great uh, six great properties to show you today, so let's get started on the first one here. It's a condo. It's 36 Lee Center Drive. Uh, it's a penthouse unit 303. Asking price here is $299,900. It's a two bedroom, two bath, uh, right at McCowan and the 401. So you've got access to the Scarborough LRT. You can uh, get to the subway Kennedy Station within like 10 or 15 minutes. Um, and you've got all kinds of great shopping at the uh, Scarborough Town Center here. So the location is pretty amazing. Um, and it does come with two parking spots, this unit, and it does have a locker as well. Maintenance fees here are $547.82, and they do include water and heat. And the unit is over uh, 900 square feet. So let's check out some of the photos. Um, pretty amazing view here from the, from the top floor penthouse suite. You've got a great open space. You've got the black appliances. Um, pretty decent floors here and I've got a slow internet connection for some reason and the photos do not want to go through. Oh, here we have uh, the uh, off section of the kitchen here, one of the master bedrooms, second bedroom and great view of Scarborough here. So actually when I say a great view of Scarborough um, I'm sure a lot of people will laugh but it is a typically a uh, good view from here. You can see it um, does face southeast, so you're getting a great view. You might be able to actually see the city from there. You never know on a good day. So that's 36 Lee Center Drive, Penthouse 303, asking price here is 299900 Next property, we have a house. This is 75 Priscilla Avenue, uh, located in the Dundas and Jane area. Asking price here is 384900 It's a semi-detached, two-story home, two bedroom, one bath, unfinished basement. This is actually a great home for a starter um, couple or a single person that wants to get into a fairly up and coming area, uh, do a little bit of work on the house and uh, could benefit from the, from the work that they do on it. Lot size here is 17 by 100 and as you can see from the photos here, it does need a little bit of work, um, not too much, but you can update this home fairly quickly. It's almost like a blank canvas. Um, you can keep the walls and maybe redo the floors. It might need some windows. Um, so it's got a lot of potential, this home, for sure. 75 Priscilla Avenue, asking price is $384,900. All right, next property, we'll get to 50, sorry, 550, 533 Richmond Street West, um, unit 503. Asking price here is $444,900. It's a one plus one, one bathroom. Right at Portland and Richmond, uh, maintenance fees here are 604, and they do come does come with a locker and parking. The fees only include water, and the unit is over 700 square feet. Beautiful unit, uh, lots of upgrades here. You can see the photos don't make it look too nice; uh, look a little bit skewed. You've got stainless steel appliances, um, beautiful floor to ceiling windows. You're going to get a northeast view here. Uh, loft style, uh, feel to the unit, hardwood floors, um, really cool funky space actually. It's a little bit unique. You've got the outside patio here and uh, great space. Very modern, funky, great location. So this is 533 Richmond Street West, unit 503. Asking price here is $444,900. All right, next property, we've got 1801 Bayview Avenue, unit 703. Um, Bayview and Eglinton area, once again, great location, $449,900. It's a two plus one, two bathroom. Uh, maintenance fees are a little bit higher on this unit here. It's an older building, um, $888. Uh, it does come with parking and locker, the fees do include water, heat and hydro, so that's kind of good, uh, good option to have. Don't have to worry about those costs because they're already built into the maintenance fees and the unit is over a thousand square feet. So um, this is good for an empty nester uh, that wants to you know, move from their home uh, into a condo, decent location, We've got lots of shopping around here, the metro is right across the street. Um, so a nice big space, you can see May not need too many upgrades to it. You know, it's nice and big um, for that price and that location. Can't go wrong. So that's 1801 Bayview Avenue, Unit 703. Asking price is 449900 
Let's get to the next property. We've got 1231 Gerard Street East. Asking price is $499,900. It's a three bedroom, one bathroom, semi detached home, uh, two story, right at Gerard and Alton. Lot size here is 18 by 110. Unfinished basement. It does have the detached uh, garage though with two car parking uh, with the laneway access. So this is one of those homes that, you know, again, slow internet connection. Do some upgrades on it, <clears throat> and uh, you could do. Actually, no, it has been renovated. Sorry, my bad. Um, so you can see some of the photos. You've got the backyard here with the detached garage. Uh, great spot to be for a first-time home buyer. Twelve thirty-one Gerard Street East. Asking price four ninety-nine nine hundred. All right, next property and the last one again. It's on Gerard. This is a detached home. Uh, Sixteen seventy-two Gerard Street East. Right at Gerard and Coxwell, asking price is $599. It's a three plus one, two bathroom, uh, two story home, partly finished basement with a separate entrance, laneway access to two car parking. And let's take a look at some of the photos here. So, again, um, newly renovated, open concept eating area with the kitchen. You've got the doors that go back to the backyard and pot lights throughout. And for some reason, I'm not getting the internet connection I want. So let's just skip that here. Okay, so this is 1672 Gerard Street East. If you have any more questions about this property, I can email you the link. Um, asking price is $5.99. So that's it for today. If you have any questions about today's listings, feel free to drop me a line via email, aj.abbate at gmail.com. Thanks for watching. Hope to see you guys again next time.